in the Olympus booth with Ray Acevedo, and I am a very recent Olympus convert. I uh, came over from Nikon, and I was curious what kind of cool stuff you guys have at the show here today at uh, Photocon LA. Well, we have everything in our lineup, but we are also showing our two most latest products, and one is our Pen F camera, our beautiful rangefinder design mirrorless camera. Let me, let me stop you real quick because I've always wondered what the difference was between like the OMD series and a pen and I don't know what it actually means to be a pen in Olympus land. Sure, uh, obviously a lot of similarities but fundamentally the OMD class of camera, the ones that resemble the SLR style, you have a prism or a viewfinder that is directly in axis with the lens line. A rangefinder style, by history, if you will, always has the viewfinder off to the far left and allowing a user to very easily look through the viewfinder but have a free eye that's able to see the scene and anticipate what's coming in and out of the frame. Now both of these viewfinders though are, are looking right at the sensor so you're not getting an off-axis problem, right? No, definitely not and it's not like the, the film range finders that did have that, that uh, issue, if you will. So this is just a personal preference which you would rather use? Yeah, yeah, in different styles. You know, the range finder historically is the street shooter's camera and uh, allowing them to just roam around and very quickly grab shots and be less uh, obvious as to what they're doing. So would you be more like, uh, likely to use prime lenses with a pen, F, uh, pen camera? Absolutely, absolutely. And uh, we have a number of them, five in our lineup, uh, very fast primes. So yes, in this case I have a 17 millimeter 1.8 lens, which is an equivalent 34. So it's the classic view for street shooting. Very, very good. It looks a little more retro too, right? Absolutely, and that's uh, by design. Uh, our, we had a film camera 40 or almost 50 years ago now that was called the Pen F, and it was a uh, system camera, interchangeable lens camera, which shot half frame film, but it looked very, very similar to this. Okay, cool. So, how much does the Pen F run? The Pen F for the body is $1,199. And uh, again, you mix and match lenses, lots of deals on lenses as well. Yeah, one of the reasons I did go with Olympus is because there are a lot of options, not just from Olympus, but also from third parties and uh, other companies we won't mention, but yeah. it gives you more flexibility. Yeah, Olympus was a, if you're at, there at the origin of the mirrorless category of cameras, and so we've had a long head start in this category. And as you said, there are 60 plus lenses out there in the market available for it. Well, speaking of lenses, you have a giant beast in your hands now. What are you showing us here? Yeah, and this rounds out our, our lens lineup beautifully. And this is our fixed focal length 300 millimeter f4 lens. Olympus calls this the highest resolution lens we've ever made. And uh, this gives you an equivalent 600 millimeter at f4. And Holy cow, and this thing is, what is that, 10 inches long, 8 inches? That's a great question. I haven't measured. It's a, it's about 11 or so. It's big, but it's not big like you'd expect a 600 to be. Exactly. Relative to the traditional SLR lenses, this is a fraction of the size and weight and cost. Uh, now, you've got it hooked up to, is this the this OMD is, EM5? This is the, e, this is the EM1 camera, and I often have it attached to this because it has the bigger built-in grip and it's a manageable package, if you will. You gotta let me hold that in my hands for a second. Can you trust me? I just wanna see what it weighs. Yeah, def okay, definitely, definitely. Okay. Holy cow, yeah, that's uh, that's not light, but dang. The lens, it's, the lens itself is 2.7 pounds. The camera is about a pound. <laughs> I'm gonna hand that back before I drop it because I don't wanna buy a broken one. <laughs> but yeah, incredibly uh, fast focusing and, and sharp lens, and it also focuses as close as 45 inches from the front element, which is amazing. Wow, for that size of lens. So you'd be picking up the eyeball of the eagle on this one. We could do that. We could do that. All right. How much did you say this costs? This is right at $2,500. And on a, an SLR type uh, lens like that, what would that cost you? About $12,000. Holy cow. So that makes it sound pretty reasonable. Plus, plus hand holding because you know, with this camera and a couple of others, we've got as much as six stops of stabilization available. 
Wow. Well, this is really cool. I wish you guys the best of luck and, like I said, a very happy Olympus camera owner. Well, that's great. Thank you. We appreciate it. All right. Now I want to give a shout out to Nanda Sims of the Olympus uh, Google Plus community that I'm a member of. And uh, hi, guys.